Hey everybody, welcome back. We are going to take a look at another MRE Nation ration. We have menu number 12, uh, pinto stew with ham. I'm actually surprised I haven't had this one yet. I'm gonna <laughs> just kind of slip down at the bottom of the chest and just didn't have it. Um, so yeah, kind of excited about this one. Very well packed, look at that. <laughs> you could... <laughs> You, maybe you, you get a little hiss off of that or something. That's crazy. All right. yeah, there was actually a little hiss. I don't think that probably didn't capture on camera, but there was a little, little release there. All right, MRE Nation. Uh, let's see, we have our accessory pack, which is uh, largely standard. Nice big old bag here. Uh, okay, uh, so yeah, spoon, again these vary, this is kind of the smaller spoon design, but they have uh, kind of like your more standard MRE spoons as well. Coffee, sugar, wet nap, salt, and pepper, Smarties, toilet paper, and coffee creamer. Oh, nice. Chocolate chip cookie. Trans fat free, buddy. Awesome. Oh, sweet. Okay, dried fruit mix. Eh, what do we got in there? Banana chips. Papaya. Pineapple. Should be pretty good. Here is uh, our standard pack. This is essentially the same in every ration you get from MRE Nation. Okay, there we go. Uh, hot beverage bag. Strawberry jam. The sweetened condensed milk spread. Regular peanut butter. Uh, there we go. True lime and true lemon here. Oh nice! Orange power stick. I don't know. I've been getting like darn near only grape. So that should be a good one to try. And then uh, wheat snack bread. Th that's interesting because uh, I'm gonna have to look back at some of these videos. I swear I've, I've only ever gotten like crackers in the standard pack for the MRE Nation. And this was all from the same uh, same case. But uh, yeah, wheat snack bread. White wheat snack bread that's trans fat free. <laughs> so yeah, that's good. That'll, that'll go good here. That's a good choice. Flameless ration heater. And finally, our pinto stew with ham. Lots of ingredients there. Nutritional facts. This is coming in the whole uh, uh, kind of like old style box instead of a sleeve. Of course, this is MRE Star, but uh, US rations, they got rid of the box a while ago. So here we go, our little package. And um, yeah, let's go ahead and get that warming up. Package does appear to be nice and full too, so it should be a good size little entree there. Now this is the uh, smaller flameless ration heater, heater, more indicative of uh, what you would see in a U.S. ration. Unfortunately with these, they are a bit tight. But, you know, they'll work. I do think that uh, some of the other heaters that MRE Nation has been using are much better than this. Obviously a lot more space, and I think the heaters work a little better, but anyway, let's go ahead and throw some water in there, try and aim in the middle of those fill lines. And I like to, you know, just set it here a little bit, try and get some of that water into all the elements. These heaters are notorious for maybe engaging one element and not the rest, but 
Don't feel it engaging quite yet. Sometimes it can take a minute, but as long as you have that water relatively saturated in there, you should be fine. And then I'm gonna stick it in this box. Now give it a little bit of insulation there. And then you can just prop that up against a rock or something and wait for it to uh, warm up, you know, 10-ish minutes. So uh, yeah, we're gonna let that go and then I will be back and get everything on the tray. All right, so we have everything out here on our tray. Let's go ahead and start opening everything. Got our white wheat snack bread. <laughs> These are always fun. <laughs> I like how they just, you know, make them in the shape of a loaf. This is very, uh, a little darker on that side, but very light on that side. Here we've got our chocolate chip cookie, Some trans fat free. Oh, look at that. Beautiful. Beautiful. A little melty on some of the chips at the top, but that's a good looking cookie. And intact. Next, our dried fruit mix. Again, what was this? Banana chips, dried papaya, pineapple. Just a couple, couple fruits there. Look at that. Yeah, it's nice. Uh, yeah, it's a nice looking little fruit mix. Not typical. Not typical. Especially for like US MREs, a lot of times all we see is, uh, you know, just uh, nut mixes. Nut raisin mix. We don't normally see a lot of like multi fruit, you know, dried fruit or anything like that. I guess it's more typical to just give you like applesauce or some you know random fruit cocktail which is fine but I think honestly I think a lot of times I'd rather just have the dried fruit than than the wet fruit at least for you know my applications uh, for rations but everybody's gonna be a little different again orange I, I'm thinking back I don't know if I've had orange their orange stick before I might have. Sometimes when you're going over a lot of these or, you know, little things like that don't always stick out. <laughs> but at any rate, I'm, I usually gravitate more towards citrus flavored drinks anyway. And the fruit punch is okay, it's just, you know, it's Kind of neither here nor there with me. It's it's just it's fine. So we've got our pinto beans, pinto bean stew with ham. Heater did a decent job. Definitely, it did take it a minute to sort of get. Oh, get out of the bag! This is these bags. Again, it it is kind of an issue. These MRE Star pouches. I think are just a little bit bigger than what the standard USMRE pouches are. Is it? It is kind of difficult sometimes to get them out of a standard US heater. But again, so many times MRE Nation gives you those a little bit bigger, nicer heaters, so you don't really have to worry about it. But when you get the normal standard size, it does tend to ouch present some trouble. All right, that's a lot of beans. Okay, so yeah, let's uh, let's go around the tray. Let's start with our uh, our fruit, maybe. A couple chips, a little bit of everything. I say pineapple pie, banana chips. I don't know. Oh, there's a piece of pineapple. Not a lot of pineapple in there. A couple of them. So pineapple, papaya, banana. Mmm. <laughs> Those banana chips are very crunchy. A little bit of package taste. 
not too much. It's a little pineapple on its own. Hmm. Yeah, um, it's a good mix. The pineapple doesn't really taste like anything, though. The banana chips are still very good and carry a flavor. The papaya, though, does seem to be the prevailing flavor in that mix, though. Not bad. Get a bit of our cookie here. Nice and crispy. Mmm. There are very few things better than a fresh, nice, crispy ration cookie. Mmm. And it's very simple. It's a very simple cookie. You, know, you periodically get that nice chomp of, of chocolate chip. It's a great cookie. It really is. Can't emphasize how nice it is to have them fresh. Let's try a little bit of our orange drink here. Okay. So that's, that's very similar to uh, the standard beverage base powder in the USMRE. Kind of more artificial <laughs> orange than, than actual orange, but that's kind of what you get. Let's get into our beans and ham and all that good stuff. Mmm, wow. God, that's actually really good. You know, onions and kind of looks like a, that's not really coming through very well, but that kind of looks like a pepper. Hmm. That's actually really good. They've, they've put, they put a good amount of flavor in here. It's like beans, beans can be very, very just blah, you know, the beans. This actually takes a lot from that ham and gives you a real nice, real nice flavor. Not overly salty, but again, just that, just that kind of flavor that ham imparts, you know, when you're doing, you know, like soup beans and cornbread. Mm. It's great. I could eat this just, just pretty much solo without any sort of enhancement there. Hmm. <laughs> I'm going to add just a little bit of heat to it. Just a little Tabasco, change the flavor a bit. But, um, but yeah, wow. I, th this was one that could be disappointing. <laughs> it definitely has the ability to be very disappointing. But, uh, but yeah, that's, that's great. Properly seasoned. And just, uh, just very, very, very tasty. And then again, yeah, I'm foregoing the peanut butter and jam jelly. I just use, I would just use the bread as like a dipping implement for this. Hmm. Yeah, that's perfect. Just put a little bit of heat in there. Get that little bit of that sours in there with the salt. Perfect. Hmm. Mm -mm -mm. This is actually a great ration. I would, uh, I'd buy this one anytime. So, so yeah, it's, it's nice and simple. Good flavors cookie. Great little little uh, fruit mix, which I would love to see incorporated in more MREs. The uh, pinto and ham stew, great. Get a little bit of your wheat snack bread. And heck, we, we still had peanut butter and jelly, which you could have later. Just in combo or solo or on a cracker or whatever. But uh, 
yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. And hopefully uh, you've enjoyed, uh, enjoyed all the past MRE Nation videos as well. So, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and finish my lunch here. Uh, so, yeah, if you haven't subscribed yet, make sure to for all the uh, existing subscribers. Thank you very much. I definitely appreciate you guys hitting that button. Uh, make sure to hit the bell if you do want notifications uh, because YouTube doesn't do that for you anymore. If you enjoyed the video, hit the like button. And as always, leave a comment down below, and we will catch you on down the road. See ya.